The human development path has shifted downwards, and these losses may be permanent, with the weakest countries being left behind after decades of catching up. Our inability to manage shared global challenges like climate change and pandemics not only threatens our well-being, but also sows division, fear and conflict around the world. No country alone can tackle challenges that spill across borders, whether a virus or a warming planet. And yet, we're stuck in gridlock, with paralyzing polarization spreading everywhere. We cannot break this gridlock by turning inwards. We need to reimagine how we cooperate. We can start by building an institutional architecture that enhances the provision of global public goods helping us to see the world as more than a zero-sum game and to come together on issues where it truly matters. We can help ease polarization by fighting misperceptions that keep us apart and by giving people the means to feel more in control of their lives. We don't have to be swept up in a whirlwind of problems, sinking deeper with each disaster. We must do better. We owe it to ourselves, to each other, and to the planet.